Hey, we got quite the forecast for our Pocono Pride on Sunday. It's looking good. However, the days leading up to it, eh, a little sketchy. But hey, nothing some good friends and good times can't fix at the campgrounds. Well, hey, and regardless, we have some drag queens to talk about too. Kay Gorgeous. Yeah, we're going to see what she's going to be up to with her Kay Pride extravaganza. As well as, yeah, good old Betty Whitecastle, everybody. She's got a song to sing about the rain. It'll melt your heart, so stick around. Your weather is coming up. Hey guys, that weather guy meteorologist Dave Allen bringing you your Pocono Pride forecast for 2023. It is looking phenomenal at this point in time for Sunday. However, those days leading up to it, yeah. Let's uh, get right to it and see why. Typically, a cold front moves from northwest to southeast. That's where we see the rain come from, the clouds, and then things just sweep out and we get pleasant conditions afterwards. Well, there is a such thing as a backdoor cold front, and that's what we're going to be getting. It's coming from the northeast and moving to the south and west. And what's going to be interesting is many people notice it. The clouds and showers are moving in the opposite direction than what they typically would be. So uh, with that said, that's coming on Saturday, and that's what we're going to have to deal with. So let's get right to it with the dailies here. For Friday for the southern Pocono region, we are going to see a very hot day. Take advantage of it. Take a dip in the pool if you get there early enough on Friday. It's going to be a magnificent day. And once we get into the latter half of the day, 4 o'clock onward, everybody, it's fair game. Mother Nature could be uh, dropping a good downpour or maybe a thunderstorm. And they will increase in coverage area as we get into the rest of the evening. And uh, the activity should dwindle down closer to midnight. So that should give you a little time frame here. But it's still, we still have the chance for some showers overnight and speaking of overnight we are getting down only to about 60 degrees so it's going to be muggy out there and once we get into our saturday here comes that uh, backdoor cold front temperatures are not going to be rising all that much we are going to be left with some clouds low clouds some showers misty conditions a cool easterly breeze in fact uh it's looking like we could actually be colder than what's depicted here models are trending uh with a colder solution so that's something to think about bring a hoodie just in case. I know we got to dress for like two seasons here. We're coming in with shorts and t-shirts in a pool and then we have to worry about hoodies on uh, Saturday. But hey, that's okay. Overnight lows getting down into the 40s here. It's going to be fantastic for your Saturday night sleeping plans. Once we get up into New Milford, here's what's interesting. A hot day for your Friday and then we watch the lows getting down to 60 degrees here. Same deal. We will be dealing with some p.m. showers and thunderstorms uh, anytime after four o'clock. But Saturday, you guys could actually wind up being a little warmer than the Poconos uh, with this uh, forecast. Getting up to perhaps those between 70, 74 degrees, it's possible. And overnight lows getting down into the 40s, it's going to be a great sleeping night. Well, hey, before we get to the Pride forecast, let's talk about some drag queens here, guys. Kay Gorgeous, what's she up to? On June 15th, she's got the Kay Pride extravaganza. Yeah, that's going to be $15, and that's at the Muckraker Beer Maker in Franklin, New Jersey. Now, this is not a BYOB. This is bring your own food, but you buy the alcohol at the bar. That's fair. Well, hey, go check out Kay. It looks like it's going to be a really good time and you can get your tickets on Eventbrite for this. Now as far as Betty White goes, I want to remind you she's got her drag brunch and it is the best drag brunch in central Pennsylvania. So get on out there. It's going to be at the HMAC. You can get your tickets at the on Eventbrite or you can go to the box office. So definitely check out Betty and her gang. And speaking of Betty, she's always having a nice ending to this weather. Check it out, she's going to be having a little song about the rain coming our way, so you might want to tune in definitely on Saturday and listen to a drag queen sing raindrops keep falling on my head. Thanks, Betty. All right, let's get right to it with your Pride forecast, guys. We are going to be seeing some plenty of sunshine here, a 20 to 30% chance of a shower early on in the day, and that's it. Some clouds, some sunshine, and who knows? Maybe if we get surprised with a little shower in the afternoon, we could get a rainbow on Pride Day. That would be fantastic with a light north breeze. Well, there you guys have it. I hope you enjoy your uh, weekend. Stay safe. 
and I will see you at camp if you are going there. Do 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 Raindrops keep falling on my head Just like the guy whose feet are too big for his bed Nothing seems to fit Those raindrops keep falling on my head They keep falling So I just did me some talking to the sun I said I didn't like the way he got things done Sleeping on the job But I'm never gonna stop the rain by complaining Because I'm free Nothing's worrying me da 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 da